Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Sean from TechJoDollars.com. He's a constant Sam Pete, and today I have another unboxing for you guys of an Aris modem. Um, nothing too fancy. Um, if you guys aren't familiar with what a modem does, it basically turns your coaxial, which is the round white or black cable that comes from your wall into internet, essentially. Um, turns it into that fat prong thing called an ethernet cable. Um, so basically, um, it changes that signal into what can be used for Ethernet, and then you plug that into your router to get Wi-Fi or into your computer to get Internet kind of uh, kind of deal there. Um, most people don't know this, um, but they're actually paying. Typically, if you have a, a cable provider, they make you pay for... Um, uh, pay, pay for their modem. So if you have any of their equipment at your house, more than likely you're paying for it as a rental fee. The disadvantages to that is basically you'd be paying for it each month. So let's say, for example, uh, Bright House is pretty popular, or I, or I am, um, for their total package, which is their modem and their router, is $10 a month. So essentially over the course of a year, you're paying $240. Um, sorry, you're paying $120 for both of them. And, I mean, there's decent uh, modem routers that you can get for about the same price. The disadvantage, let's say you get rid of them after a year, you are uh, you don't get anything, you know. At least if you have it, you could have the option to sell it down the road or keep it for another provider or whatever um, you would like to do with it. Um, so, by buying your own equipment, kind of uh, cuts them out as a middleman. And, uh, basically, you don't have to worry about them, you know, interrupting... Uh, or excuse me, charging you more for uh, for the service. And let's say if commitment is a big thing to you, let's say you're not sure if you're going to be with them for a while. True, you know, let's say you're only with them for three months, that's only nine bucks, so that's not bad, but let's say you're with them for three years, now you're talking about you just spent $360, when if you bought your own equipment, you might dish out 150 for the equipment, and you also have it to keep. So that's just something to keep in mind. Most cable providers do it. Um, it's kind of like a PSA here, actually. So if you guys want to check your cable bills, um, definitely look for that rental charge on there if you have equipment. So anyways, this is an Aris modem router. Um, it's one of their better ones. It's actually a uh, 6190. Um, so it does up to 1.4 gigabits. So most people's internet's anywhere from 10 to 50 gigabit, or excuse me, megabits, and 1,000 megabits is one gigabit, so this is very fast. 32 um, is the amount of streams it can handle. Um, downstream channels, uh, it's their top one out of these three models that you guys can see here, and this retails for about 150. Um, you can pick it up at most major retailers or even Aris's website um, itself. So let me uh, open it and show you guys what you got which we got going on in here. Um, by the way, you can see it works with Xfinity, Time Warner, which also Bright House is a, is a subsidiary of Time Warner, Cox, and it also has a two-year limited warranty. So let's uh, get this open. So it's pretty straightforward. Um, crack the seal there, open it up. You get your modem here. Pretty. <laughs> White box there. And power cable. You're gonna need that, your AC adapter. And an Ethernet port cord, more than likely. Yep. So this is an Ethernet. This is what plugs into your router. Um, I have quite a few of them, so I probably won't need them. However, need that one. However, um, it's nice to have it. So on the back, very straightforward. You have your power, um, which you're going to need to power the device. Where you're, you're plugging your AC port cord. Um, you have that coaxial input, which is this right here. Um, that's what I said. So basically it's the same input that you even use for your TV. Um, your house should have a bunch of them and that's what cable providers use for TV and internet. Um, and I believe phone as well. Um, and then you have one Ethernet port on the back too. So you can plug in um, it to your router and your router typically has four. So you'll get a few more after you plug it into a router or even a switch. Um, so this isn't meant to be used too much as a standalone device unless let's say you only have one computer 
more than likely you're plugging this into a router and then that's going to give you a bunch more and then obviously the main benefit of a router is going to be the Wi-Fi so you can connect wireless devices. So anyways guys, um, this is my unboxing of the Air Surfboard um, 6190. I'll let you guys know how I uh, how I like it, but so far so good. Um, everything's looking good. Um, so I'll hook it up, return my equipment back to Bright House and save myself $3 a month for having my own mode. Um, if you guys have any questions even pertaining to, uh, to you know, house gadgets and uh, connected, um, connected house um, gadgets, you know, electronics, routers, modems, doorbells, security cameras, stuff like that, feel free to drop it in the comments. Um, if you really like the video and really like me, I really appreciate a uh, subscription um, so you guys can subscribe um, over to my channel. And, uh, you know, I try to put out videos more frequently, um, kind of supply and demand. So you guys demand more videos. I'll definitely try to get them out there for you guys. So anyways, uh, any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments. Um, other than that, you guys have a nice day and I'll talk to you guys in a later video. Goodbye.